Hey guys, Drake here with the Nectar Bar and today we are day 38 of quarantine 2020. Today is April 30th and tomorrow is May 1st, which we are supposed to reopen. We are supposed to reopen and I'm not sure exactly what that means, um, but many of us I know are probably still going to stay at home. But I'm out in the habitat today and I was just discovering all kinds of different um, chrysalids and, and things throughout the habitat and how mother nature is kind of cool. Um, this right here is a Gulf fritillary chrysalis. It sure did blend in with that tree. Camouflage is really, really cool. Um, but yeah, I noticed it and I have quite a few of these little babies around and about in the habitat and I was like kind of just going through and discovering what what kind and where they are and so here they've kind of lined up all around the pot and then as I'm coming through the habitat over here um, I noticed that I have a caterpillar about to go into its chrysalis it's Jane right there. But then as I came around, I noticed that, well, there's one that's on my garage door. And so this is not really a good place for it. Now, typically I like to leave nature alone, but this one specifically, it's not in a good area and I do want it to survive. So. What I'm going to do is carefully remove it. And how I'm gonna do that is I have just some water. This is actually some rain water. Um, but if you have a spray bottle of water, um, that would work too. But if you don't, you don't actually need one. I'm just gonna wet my fingers and my hands are clean. I've just washed them. So I know I don't have any type of chemicals. And I'm just going to carefully Put some water where the silk would be. Now when butterflies um, get ready to go into their chrysalis, they lay a silk pad and this helps them attach to whatever they've chosen was a good spot. This one in particular wasn't. <laughs> so I'm gonna help it move and I'm just gonna wait just a few seconds and then I'm going to carefully just kind of scratch at the silk. Then I'm gonna carefully pull. I'm getting right under as close, if I can zoom in here, as close to the cream ester as I can. And I'm going to lightly, very lightly and slowly peel it off. And that's all that it takes. And that is done very carefully. And then I'm gonna allow that silk to dry. And then I'm gonna hang it from that silk. Um, if you can kind of see, there's the silk is still left there. I'm gonna let it dry. And then I'm gonna hang it from that silk so that it can still be in a hanging position. Um, and it has plenty of room for the wings to expand once it emerges. So there is your daily 2020 video. Um, our quarantine is close to me and over maybe. We don't know just quite yet, but there you go. This is a Gulf fritillary that was just rescued from an area that was not particularly good for it. And now it can be free to um, emerge as it needs to. So until next time, peace, love and butterflies.